Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to change from a physical SIM card over to an eSIM in Mint Mobile. It's pretty quick and easy. So let's jump right in. But first, check out the link below. My partner, Mint Mobile, gave it to me and it gives you a great discount off of their cell plans. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is hop into your App Store or Google Play Store if you're on Android. And you're just going to type in Mint Mobile here and you're going to find Mint Mobile app and download and install it because you can do everything in the app itself. After you've done that, let's open up the app and you're just going to log into your account. Now, after we've done that, let's tap on account at the bottom right. And you can see a bunch of information. I'm just going to scroll down and I'm going to tap on order replacement SIM here. And it says, do you need a new eSIM? And I'm going to hit, I want to order a new SIM. And it says order replacement SIM. Do you want to have a SIM card, a physical SIM card or replacement for your current eSIM? I'm going to hit replacement for eSIM. And this is my device. Now it says you're ordering an eSIM. Basically you can see the price is for free. It doesn't charge you anything. And it says just here, check out at the very bottom. It'll go through the steps of processing that new eSIM on your phone and activating everything for you. After that, you're gonna wanna hop into your settings here and then tap on cellular. And you can see here is my line and there is my electronic SIM card at the very bottom. You can see delete eSIM. So this is my eSIM. It has my network mint mobile and my phone number, all that different stuff. You can check everything on here and make sure that eSIM is working normally. Now, if you have that physical SIM card still in your phone, you can just pop it out. You can throw it away. You don't need it anymore. You can just leave it empty. Or if you wanted another cell plan, you could always put Put a different SIM card in there and use that other cell plan. Hope this helps. If you have any questions on that, leave them in the comments down below and I'll catch you on the next one.